Um, excuse me, uh, are you okay? No, no, don't be sorry, it's, it's okay. Come on, cheer up, look, I've, I've got candy, like, really good candy from rich neighborhoods, I mean, not snack-sized stuff, like, oh, that's not why you're upset. Uh, can I take a seat next to you? What's wrong? Come on, don't cry. It's Halloween, the happiest night of the year. Why would you ever be crying on Halloween night? There's candy and costumes and scary movies and it's just, it's lovely. I don't see how someone could be sad on a night like tonight. Hmm? Some kids were bothering you. Were they saying mean things or... I see. Kids are mean and stupid and... <sighs> I'm sorry they ruined your Halloween. Here, take this. No, oh, come on, take it. I know you're upset, but... It's better to be upset eating candy than upset not eating candy. But, really, those kids say they're stupid, and one day they won't be like this, I promise. See, some kids are just too boring and bland to have fun for themselves, so they tease other kids like you to make themselves feel better because, really, they know how cool you are, and they're just too stubborn to admit it. They're just jealous. Mm-hmm. That's how kids are. They know how fun and lovely you must be, and they're just mad that they aren't that fun, so they take it out on you. It's terrible, but hey, who needs them, right? They're mean, jealous little brats, and you, well, <laughs> you're amazing. Plus, we have all the best candy. <laughs> I'm Ross, by the way. And you are? Oh, I like it. Well, nice to meet ya. So, uh, if you don't mind me asking, those kids who mess with you, do you know their names? No. Are you sure? Okay, okay. No, no, I just... I just don't want them to mess with you again. Ever. I mean, really, you didn't even do anything to them, right? I mean, why were they messing with you in the first place? Oh, God. I'm so, so sorry. I just... I wish I could have stopped them from even seeing you. Punk kids. I hate it. Yeah, I... I know what it's like to be bullied. See, I'm... Well, I'm a little different from most kids, and growing up everyone knew that, so... I was always the black sheep, always the butt of the joke, always being laughed at and never laughed with. See, I... How do I explain this? Huh? I can tell you anything. <laughs> I mean... I appreciate that, I really do, but if I told you, well, you wouldn't look at me the same. You'd be all scared, and you wouldn't want to be my friend, just like everyone else. Really? You mean it? Okay, so no matter what I say, you'll still be my friend. Well, okay then. See, I'm very, very different from literally everyone else I know. My family, they... Okay, you said you'd still be my friend no matter what I told you, so are you, are you still sure? Okay, okay. My family, they're killers. See, I'm a... 
vampire. And, uh, well, yeah, that's what vampires do. My family hunts and kills humans in order to feed off of them. All of the kids at my vampire school do the same thing, and then there was me. I just... I couldn't do it. I mean, humans seem so sweet and innocent, almost like vampires, but, well, nicer. I wouldn't kill a single human, so everyone in my life, my school, my family, my friends, they all thought I was some softy human lover, and well, I guess I was. And trust me, no one at school wants to hang out with a human lover like me. And so, I figured if my vampire family and classmates won't accept me, then maybe the humans will. So I started hanging around malls and arcades, wherever there were a lot of humans just having fun. And I started making a few friends here and there, and things were great. But eventually, they found out about me being a vampire, and um... Well, to say that I didn't want to be friends anymore would be an understatement. I was yelled at, called names, they threw garlic at me and they... They tried to stab me with wooden stakes like... I... I didn't understand. I was open with them, I was honest and they... They just... They hated me. They hated me so, so much for something out of my control. They hated me because I was born a vampire. So, my vampire family hated me because I liked humans. And the humans hated me because I had a vampire family and, um... Well, here I am. It's Halloween nights, the one night where I can come out, be myself, and not be judged so harshly. But if people knew that these fangs in my mouth weren't fake, ugh, they'd have the garlic out in an instant. So... Um, there it was. I'm <laughs> different. My own kind doesn't like me, and humans certainly don't like me, but, um, do you still... Really? <laughs> you are the first and only human to say that they like me, even though I'm a vampire. <laughs> so, friends... Um, I know that you don't really know me that well, but thanks, you know, just for being cool with me and not freaking out, but, um, I understand if you don't want to hang out with me after tonight, tonight I'm free to be me, but after Halloween, if we were to keep hanging out, it'd, it'd have to be in secret, for the safety of both of us. If the vampires knew I was hanging out with a human, they'd come for both of us, and if humans knew you were hanging out with a vampire, well, they'd do the same. We'd have the world against us. But, um, I still want to be your friend, even though people may not like it. Who cares, right? You're my friend, and we're gonna hang out. We're gonna explore and have fun and do everything that friends are supposed to do, right? And if anyone tries to come after us, I'll protect you. I won't hurt anyone, but I'm really fast and good at hiding, so we'll be safe. There'll be nothing to worry about. <laughs> right? Right. Well, what do you want to do now? I can walk you home if you'd like, or we can go trick-or-treating, or, you know, whatever you want. Yeah? Alright, sounds like a plan.